Hey everybody, how we doing today? What? How we doing today? Yeah. Maybe a small but mighty group, but we are mighty indeed. Welcome to the eighth annual New Orleans Cigar Box Guitar Festival. Thanks y'all for coming on out. We got three days of cigar box builders. We got symposiums. We got uh, vendors. The Louisiana Louisiana Blue Society is outside. We have merchandise table and three days of great music. Uh, Want to give a big shout out to the guys doing sound. We got Danny, Danny, and Travis back there. Can we give them a big round of applause? Because uh, these instruments are pretty finicky, so it takes a pretty steady uh, ear to keep them going. So we're gonna get started right now with our first act, all the way from Australia. He, in fact, he just finished touring in Australia. He's out there the last two months. He just got back to the States on Friday, about a week ago, so it was a little bit of a weather shock. Um, he's been playing roots and blues music. Uh, this will be his sixth time appearing here at the New Orleans Cigar Box Guitar Festival. He's got two records here. Um, Mississippi Delta Bound and Montserrat. They'll both be on the merchandise table. And uh, Mississippi Delta Bound is also was number uh, two on the Australia Blues uh, and Roots Music Chart. But before I bring him up, I also want to give one more shout out to all of the sponsors here. Offbeat Magazine, CB Giddy Grafter Supply, WWOZ FM, Louisiana Music Factory, WWLTV, New Orleans Blues Society, MGB Guitars, Threadhead Music Foundation, Lace Music Products, Hotel De La Monet, Rocket Farm Guitars, Envy Cafe, Rob's Cigar Box Guitars, Steve Arvey's Killer CBG Strings, Soul Country Podcast, and the New Orleans Jazz Museum. Without further ado, please give it up for Mr. Ivor S. K. Murph there for introducing me. Thanks everyone for coming out for the uh, kickoff of the uh, New Orleans Cigar Box Guitar Festival. It's about as funky and soulful as it gets when it comes to instruments. I might start off here with a little, uh, little Mick and Keith. Yeah, man. 
They give me how to honk it on blood. Yes, appreciate it. So did anyone here own a cigar box guitar who's come to see the gigs? Yeah. <laughs> I know they're kind of they're addictive, hey. It's one by a guy, it's called uh, Carl's Custom Guitars, a guy in Minnesota makes them. And they're the only cigar boxes that's still open. So you can keep your whatever you need to bring to your gigs right in your guitar, you know, <laughs> whatever it may be. Um, Although I will say, I tried to order one of these for my tour of Australia I just got back from, and I've not heard back from Carl, so if anyone knows Carl <laughs> or knows where he is, I'm looking for him, because <laughs> there's a guitar in the offing, but um, yeah, they're beautiful, beautiful guitars. Just have that sort of thing, you know, the homemade, a little bit of human love's gone into each one, which is a little different to most instruments. tune here called Take the Good with the Bad, a little Swamp Blues number off my last album, Montserrat. Thank you. 
wanna sell my heart, yeah, I know I should. Most beat up place in a neighborhood. You can't see out the windows, and there's holes in the floor. But a big loud woman yeah, live right next door. Ain't it said you got her? Show said you got her. Ain't it said you got her? Show said you got her. Ain't it said you got her? Take the good with the bad. Thank you, thank you, cheers. So I uh, might dig deep into the uh, Delta Blues songbook here. This was taught to me as the stairway to heaven of the blues. This is called the Mississippi Delta Blues by a guy called Willie Brown. Um, not the Willie Brown associated with Robert Johnson, but Another guy who was recorded by the Library of Congress. They, he was working in Mississippi and they recorded two songs from him. And this was one of them, the Mississippi Delta Blues. I think I've heard Johnny Winter do it first. So um, this is my attempt at it anyway. <laughs> Going back to the Delta, where I can have my fun. Going back to the Delta, oh, where I can have my fun. Said I can drink, toast, smoke, and gamble. I can bring my baby home. Thank you. 
Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Cheers. So uh, Murph mentioned earlier an album I put out called uh, Mississippi Bound. Um, this is a little tune off that, a little uh, solo acoustic blues thing I did on that called Kiss on My Blues. So this is a... Uh, little maiden run on the cigar box here. Watch you roll those hips and let your backbone dip. The night has just begun, and I want to see the sun. Cause you know what to do. Come here and kiss on my blues. Cheers. <coughs> right. A little tune here off the first album I ever released. This owes a lot to uh, owes a lot to Jimmy Reed actually, whose namesake's playing at the festival tomorrow. Little Jimmy Reed. So Jimmy Reed was a fantastic boogie blues player from Mississippi who made his name in Chicago. Um, he had basically two forms of songs, but they were killer, and he just had hit after hit after hit with the same song with a different name. So this is a uh, one of his varieties of songs, or a spin-off thereof. This is called I Like The Way. Yeah, yeah. 
song called uh, Don't Say Goodbye. I wrote this when I was about 15 or 16, I think. I've gone through a few variations thereof since, but it's a little minor swampy blues thing. I'm gone Said I'm gone Back out on the prowess Don't need you in a home You're down and on You said it ain't fair Now tell you the truth I don't really care hey, Don't say goodbye Thank you. Thank you. 
bit of a bottleneck here, hey? Which I kind of have to with a cigar box guitar. I'm gonna do one of my favorite blues tunes here. One of my favorite blues players ever is a guy called uh, Sonny Boy Williamson too. A phenomenal harmonica player. And probably songwriter, phenomenal blues lyricist too. Compositions. This is called Don't Start Me to Talking. Signifying is cause somebody got to go. Jack gave his wife two dollars to get something to eat now. She get on the street and old Joe stopped her. And he knocked her down. He blackened her eye. She get back home, she tell her husband a lie, yeah. Don't start me to talking, cause I tell everything I know. Gonna break up the signifying, yes, cause somebody got to go. Jim honked his home, she began to stop. She said, take me, baby, it's around the block. Cause I'm going to the beauty shop to get my hair chopped, yeah. Don't start me to talking, cause I tell everything I know. Break up the signifying, cause somebody got to go. Thank you, thank you, cheers. Which is how it in tune for a whole tune there. Oh, nearly. Anyone's first festival? First cigar box festival? Oh, nice, unreal, guys. Still easy. Thanks for coming out. That's huge. Yeah, you've got some uh, killer players ahead of you. Uh, Janky's on after me, which will be killer. And then there's unreal music all weekend. Galia Vault tomorrow. If anyone's seen Galia, she's <laughs> something else, hey? favorite tune to a little Warren Zevon tune called Karma Leader. <laughs> I am Maria 
such a static on my radio In the tube they glow in the dark And I'm there with her and it's an auto When I'm here in Echo Park Call my leader, hold me tighter Yes, I think I'm sinking down Cause I'm all strung out on heroin On the outskirts of town Well, I'm sitting here playing solitaire With my pearl hand of death and the county won't give me no more methadone And they've cut off your welfare check Call my leader, hold me tighter Yes, I think I'm sinking down Cause I'm all strung out on heroin On our skirts of town so I'll pump my Smith Corona And I went to meet my man Well, it hangs out down on Alvarado Street Down by the pond there, chicken stand Call my leader, hold me tighter Yes, I think I'm sinking down Cause I'm all strung out on heroin On our skirts of town Call my leader, hold me tighter Well, I think I'm sinking down Cause I'm all strung out on heroin Skirts of town Thank you very much. Cheers. Got the key to the highway, bet I'm bound to go. Well, I'm gonna leave here running, cause walking's much too slow. Well, I'm going back to the border, yes, where I'm veteran on. Yeah, yes, cause you ain't done nothing. Yes, drive me away from home. So when that moon, yeah, peer over mountain, said I'll be on my way. Cause I'm gonna leave here running until the break of day. So give me 
one, yeah, smoke yes, baby. Well, just before I go, yeah. cause when I leave this time, I ain't a coming a back no more. I got the key to the highway, bet I done bound to go. Well, I'm gonna leave here running, yes, cause walking's much too slow. Well, I'm gonna leave here running, yes, cause walking's much too slow. I'm gonna leave here running. Cause walking's much too slow Yes, 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 thank you very much, shit yeah. A little song that Dr. John wrote for his mom called Dorothy. <coughs> Still got time for a few more guys. Soul number here off my latest album. Lead single off it, a little thing called Sweet and Low. You don't know what you do when treating eyes all day. You don't know what you do when it's making out in place. You don't know what you do when it's when you slide my way. Oh, you know I can't let go. Oh, when it's sweet and a 
and slow And all the things you see yeah, Is where they drip with ease And all the things you see yeah, Is moment by degree And all the things you see yeah, They got an easy tea Oh, you know I can't let go Oh, when it's sweet and it's slow To a little ska thing on the album, but uh, originally started life as a little R&B version. So, going to give a tune called Mississippi Bound a go. In the Prince Buster ska '50s Jamaican vein on the uh, on the album, so a little bit of a different vibe. But I'm going to see if I can put a little '50s R&B spin on it. Solitude is calling, and it's running to the ground. Yeah, and I can hear the river rolling. Yeah, some Mississippi bound. Yeah, 
Like I'm a suitcase in my pocket, yes. I'm meant to sit up at my home. All right, everybody, please give it up for Mr. Iver S. K. Don't forget, he's got his two CDs for sale outside on the merchandise tent. It's also where the Louisiana Blues Society is. Uh, so you can get Mississippi Bound and Montserrat, and we're going to get the stage ready. And then we're going to have Ed Wills coming up. And after that, we're going to have Janky and the Juke Joint Boys. Also, the bar is now open. So if you want to go visit Donnie and get a drink while we get the stage ready, uh, please do so. Thank you.
Hey everybody, how we doing? Yes, come on, how we doing? All right. Day one of the eighth annual New Orleans Cigar Box Guitar Festival. Our next musician has been playing music now for over five decades. He's toured the South, East Coast, and Europe. And you can currently catch him playing six nights a week all around the city. The Tipsy Trumpet, The Hideout, and Bambulas. With four albums under his belt, including a brand new one. Please give it up. And making his debut here at the New Orleans Cigar Box Guitar Festival on a cigar box. Please give it up for Ed Wills. Thank you. Thank you very much. As much as I play, I'm nervous as hell up here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I was born in 1958. I don't know if that makes a difference or not, but um, it's a lot of music. Back in the 60s, I went to a small private Catholic school. And the nuns used to teach us music. And they were pretty good about teaching me the music that I was accustomed to. So as I spell so. Sunshine when she's gone. It's not warm when she's away. There ain't no sunshine when she's gone. She's all it's gone too long. When any time she goes away. I wonder this time where she's gone. Wonder if she's going to stay. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone in this house. Ain't no home anytime she goes away. And I know, 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 no, I know, I know, I know, I know, no, I know, I know. Whoa, I ought to leave the young thing alone. Cause ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Only darkness every day. There ain't no sunshine when she's gone. In this house, ain't no home. Anytime she goes away. There's a reason why I chose that song. There's a reason why I chose that song, because when I, when I was a boy, we heard that song, and um, on the other side of the 45, well, some of y'all don't know what a 45 is. On the other side of the 45, there was another song called Better Off Dead. And no, you never heard that song because after you wore out the first side, you didn't play the other side. So I'm gonna try it like this. By the way, we recorded this. Oh, she couldn't stand me anymore, so she just took the kids and went. You see, I've got a drinking problem. All the money we had, I spent. Now I must die by my own hand, cause I'm not man enough for 
to live alone She's better off without me And I'm better off dead Now that she's gone Now that she's gone She gave the most, took the least She even had a priest come to our home Lord, I cried, I prayed, I promised God that I'd leave the stuff alone. Now I must die by my own hand, cause I'm not man enough to live alone. She's better off without me, and I'm better off dead now that she's gone. Now that she's gone She used to call her friends and cry But the man turned off the phone Lord, she'd sit and cry while I went out and pawned the things we own. Now, I must die by my own hand, because I'm not man enough to live alone. She's better off without me, and I'm better off dead now that she's gone. Now that she's gone. Now that she's gone. Now that she's gone. Thank you. Like I said, we recorded that song a couple of years ago during the pandemic because we didn't have anything else to do. <laughs> That's all right. I know you got another man, but that's all right. Every now and again, I wonder who's loving you tonight. Late last night, I knocked on your door. Heard a voice inside say, you can't come in no more. That's all right. I know you love another man, but that's all right. Every night again, I wonder who's loving you tonight. One thing for certain woman, without a doubt, I can't come in, you know that sucker? Show sure, better I come out. That's all right. I know you got another man up in there, but that's all right. And then again, I wonder who's loving you tonight?
Something happened in my house. Never happened before. He broke down my bed and made up my woman on my floor. That's all right. I know you got another man up in there, but that's all right. Every night again, I wonder who's loving you tonight. Thank you. I want to dedicate this song to my ex-wife. first one. I'm going to hell for that one. <laughs> Heavenly Father, up above, have mercy on me. After seven years of bad, bad love, I finally got free. I don't mean to seem ungrateful But you answered my prayer And Father, if you're able Don't let me do the same damn thing all over again You get the fever, you get the itch And you forget about the mess you were in Forget about the money, lawyers and the pain, and do the same damn thing all over. Oh ho ho, oh ho ho, oh ho ho, whoa. Almighty Father, great and good, you need to be in my shoes. Let me fall in love just like before. Now I'm stepping in a big pile of the blue. Well, now the honeymoon is over. Let's not pretend. I guess I never learned my lesson. I did the same damn thing all over again. You get the fever. You get the itch, and you forget about the mess you were in. You forget about the money, lawyers and the pain, and do the same damn thing all over again. Oh ho ho, oh ho ho, oh ho ho, whoa. Mother Mary, Father Joe, I need to talk to your son. He had trouble just like mine, and he's the chosen one. But if I ever go to heaven, will that be the end? Will I fall for some sweet little angel? And do the same damn thing all over again. You get the fever, you get the itch, and you forget about the mess you were in. You forget about the money, lawyers and the pain, and do the same damn thing all over again. Thank you. Those two songs are by Kev Moore. Uh, Kevin Moore. Kev Moore, as y'all would call him.
One of the first songs I learned when I was a kid. My dad had a real strange sense of humor. You don't teach seven-year-old kids how to play this. Clapping on the two and the four. You can count it. One, four. Don't try the one and the three, that's kind of messed up. See me worry. Well, it's you I hate to lose. Nobody loves me. Nobody seems to care. Nobody loves me, baby. Nobody seems to care. Speaking of hard luck and trouble, well, you know I've had my share. This is my first time at the Cigar Box Festival. 
It's also my first time playing the cigar box. <laughs> I got some of the best guitars in the world, but I've never played on the cigar box before. They asked me if I wanted the four string or the six string. I said, well, the six string, because that's what I'm used to. Three o'clock in the morning, baby. I can't even close my eyes. It's three o'clock in the morning, baby. I can't even close my eyes. I've been trying to find my baby. And I just can't be satisfied. around me, people. My baby just can't be found. So I looked all around me, people. My baby just can't be found. I believe I'm going on down at a whole bowling ground. Goodbye, everybody. Believe it's coming to the end. Goodbye, everybody. I believe this is the end. If anybody find my baby, tell them, please forgive me for my sins. I had the honor of telling Mr. B.B. King that I couldn't sing that song and play it at the same time. He said, that's not a problem. Just sing the song.
Thank you. Thank you.
Say I'm going to get up in the morning I better leave out dust my broom Get up in the morning, baby. Didn't leave out dust my broom. I done quit my best girl. Now my friend's gonna get my room. See, I'm gonna write a letter. Tell from everybody I know. Gonna write a letter, baby. Tell from everybody I know. She found in the East Monroe. See, I don't want no woman. Downtown man she meets. I don't want no woman. Want every downtown man she meets. Well, it ought to be a locust. Shouldn't let her walk the streets. I believe, believe it won't be long. I believe. Thank you. I get a lot of mileage out of this particular song. and said, have a nice day. She had me right where she wanted. Man, I was in a trance. She said, nothing wrong with Texas, but I'd really love to go to France. I would do most anything, but I'm still making payments on her wedding ring. Went to my employer, Mr. Hayes. I said, working like a mother, I'm about a doggone race. He said, money's tight. Man, you know it just ain't no chance. I said, would you reconsider? If my baby wants to go to France. I see us walking. Down the Chancellor's Exchanging kisses in a small French cafe. Wake up, mama. Don't you fret. I found two cheap tickets on the internet. We leave on a Monday here. For two whole weeks, and all we got to do is just eat and sleep. I had her right where I wanted. Man, she was in a trance. I said, Nothing wrong with Louisiana. You and I are going to France. Lord, ain't nothing wrong with Louisiana. You and I are going to France. Parlez-vous français? Am I, am I good? I gotta go. I gotta go 
some more? <laughs> I'm ready to get out of here. <laughs> Some old fashioned stuff, that's just what I was thinking about. Since I met my baby, my whole life has changed. Since I met you, baby, my whole life has changed. Friends all tell me that I'm not the same. Since I met you, baby, Since I met you, baby, all I need is you. system so you always know where you are thank you thank you very much give it up for Mr. Ed Wells don't forget you can catch Ed six days a week here playing around town at the Tipsy Trumpet uh, the Hideout and uh, Bamboulas. He's got four records that are all online, and his most recent albums just came out as Ed Wills and Blues for Sale Live. Nice. We're going to get the stage ready for our next act, Janky and the Juke Joint Boys. Don't forget to visit Donnie out by the bar. And we also have our merchandise table, and there's plenty of cigar box guitars out there to go check out. So stick around for our next act. Thank you so much.
Full Effect. This is our Thursday kickoff. And this is our next act. Friends are playing music. He found his way to the Mississippi and the Hill Country Blues and learned from some of the best there, including Reverend K.R. Williams and Robert Kimbrough. Absorbed this music, started producing these records, and created a band to share with everybody. Please give it up for Jakey and the Juke Joint Boys! Like he said, we're gonna go up way in North Mississippi. Way, so just about 45 minutes south of Memphis. It's a really cool story because all the Delta guys there in Clarksdale and everybody, they went to Chicago and created a whole new style of blues called Chicago blues. They added guitars and stuff. Well, over there in uh, Holly Springs, they just stayed there. And had juke joints, Mississippi Fred McDowell, Jesse May Hemphill, R.L. Burnside. They created this really simple music that is fun and it just makes you want to move your body, right? It does that. Because <laughs> I, I want to move my body. So what we got, they stayed in this vacuum and they created this music and it stayed true to exactly what it is. And I'm privileged uh, to be able to play with musicians uh, like the Kimbrose, the Burnsides, uh, so I've produced albums and stuff, but man, that music to me, it hits me in my soul. And it's all based on a gospel beat. Give me that one, two beat real quick. And that makes you want to move, right? So that's that gospel beat. And that's what they did because they did it in the church or they did it in the cotton fields. But this is way up, like I said, Holly Springs, Mississippi. So after you hear me play, I want you to go home and I want you to listen to... to all the greats like Jesse May Hemp Hill, R.L. Burnside, Junior Kimbrough, because this is their music and I'm just doing it my way. Cody Cotton, play for me, brother. Mr. Chaz, CC. I'm Janky, y'all. I'm originally from Shreveport, Louisiana. I used to sleep, swim in that Red River. Baby, ride. Oh, you better let my baby ride. Oh, you better let my. 
Again, that's hill country music there, so I kind of doing my own thing here. <laughs> Gotta stay janky, y'all. This, so this is a song I wrote called Riding High and Living Low.
Talk to me, go to God, and come on now. Thank you very much. That's a song I wrote. There's another song I wrote. This is off my, my, my newest CD. And funny enough, it's called CBG Throwdown. And that's code for cigar box guitar, if you didn't know that already. You maybe hope so. I like to write songs about having a good time, dancing. I know we don't have a dance floor, but you can get up in a little area. You can come on stage if you want. But this song is called Shake It On Down. Just shake your hips down to the bone. We're feeling good cause we're right at home. Shake it up high, shake it down low, shake it all around, baby. Oh, shake it on down. Having good times, it's for damn show. We're packing heat, we get the flow. Check out my guns, cause they just might blow. Shake it up high, shake it down low. Shake it all around, baby. Oh, shake it on down. Looking tasty. Don't know karate, but I know crazy. We're dropping bombs. We making craters. Holy in the flow with the juke joint shakers. Hey, leave it up high, shake it down low, shake it all around, baby. Oh, uh, shake it on down. Down. Yeah, I'll give it up for Cody Cotton. Got CC on the drums back there and DB on the bass. Double bass, look at that. Yeah, so like I said, I'm originally from Shreveport, Louisiana. I moved to Dallas, Texas when I was 18 years old. And I've had the blues with me the whole time. But then I moved to Austin recently, and man, I'm telling you what. They're some of the best musicians in the world in Austin, Texas. They don't mess around. They tell me more, more about my music than I know about my own damn music. This here is a song I wrote. I don't know why I wrote it, but it's called Ain't No Reason, It's Just Because. Knock me down to bend that knee 
like it was. Ain't no reason, it's just because. Expect that. Yeah, we talked about this earlier about your first wife. I wrote one of the meanest songs I've ever written. It ain't this song, because I don't know if I can play it. This song's called What You Done Done. And that's another song I wrote about my ex-wife. That other song's called You Must Be the Devil's Favorite. I don't know, man. That might win an award right there. That's probably the most expensive song I've ever written. And why did they say, why, they say, why is it so expensive to get a divorce? Cause it's worth it. I'm sorry, man. I don't want to bring y'all down, but this is the blues now. Come on.
Nothing makes it easy like a hole in the ground Day by day, running away Oh, when you go, make sure you stay What you done, done? What you done, done? Juke John boys, please, come on. So I hope this still qualifies. This is not a cigar box, okay? This is what you call a Bible box. This is what you store a Bible in, and I made it into a God. My friend made it into it. I didn't do that. So I'm going I'm to go back up there in that hill country. So that's my Louisiana coming out again. I'm going to go back up there in the hill country. Hill country, Mississippi. 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 Mississippi up there. Yeah, just south of Memphis, where the king lives. <laughs> this is a song by Jessie Mae Hemphill, man. She's the she-wolf. Fries. These days, 
You're gonna be spending some money at McDonald's. Right? So Jessie Mae, when she wrote this song here, this song's called Hard Times. And the next part, the next verse is so fitting. She says, gas is high, yeah. Gas is high, yeah. Can't only drive. I can't only drive. Groceries high, yeah. Groceries high, yeah. Can't only ride. Can't only ride. tonight I'm telling you I know you probably gonna want to get a cocktail but you maybe have a high five just go and try to find Jesse May Hemp Hill and listen to her cuz you will be happy and you go that damn janky boy was right <laughs> am I lying <laughs> Let me switch guitar or right, I'm sorry CBGs real quick He didn't do the strap, I did the strap. Terrible. So uh, when you, I play in Mississippi a lot. Um, and uh, it's juke joints. It's, man, that's the way to life. It's just an amazing thing. We was playing once at a place called Reds in Clarksdale, Mississippi. And man, we're just throwing down with the Kimbros, the Burnsides. And uh, boy, look up. It just kind of split like the Red Sea. All of a sudden, this little guy comes walking up, and I just take my guitar off, and I give it to him. Wait, little how? <laughs> well, he, he, I ain't too tall myself now. Come on. <laughs> so that guy comes walking up, and I just take my guitar. It's Kingfish. If you know who Kingfish I said, give my guitar. And this, he, he ain't little. This guy here, this guy here, you know what he said? I gave him my guitar. He said, well, you might want to get rid of that guitar. I said, why? He said, he done played it all. Ain't nothing you can play on it. <laughs> Hey, oh man, come on, that ain't right. True story. <laughs> True story. Whole thing. He knows. See, I they ain't lying. <laughs> but at a juke joint, there ain't no stage. Maybe there might be carpet. And there, it's just a full of people. There's a band playing some music, and then songs go on for 12, 15 minutes.
Got your tambourine back there? So I wrote this song here because when you play at a juke joint, in Mississippi especially, there's going to be most likely a beautiful, beautiful woman and she's got a tambourine and her sole job is to get people dancing and work that tambourine. So I wrote a song. I ain't gonna say who her name is, but she's a great woman. So this song is called Juke Joint Shaker. Jackie, y'all. Y'all break it down. So we go to Mississippi one time, and there's this mean girl. She's from Brooklyn, New York. 
I ain't got nothing on nobody in Brooklyn, but this woman ain't nice. We ain't supposed to talk about her. So she, she been ripping off all these Mississippi musicians. Well, this beautiful woman with a tambourine, she on stage, her daddy playing music. This little old girl grabs money out of the dang tip jar. So my juke joint lady here goes upside her head with that tambourine. Goes upside her head with that tambourine. I said, is there still blood on the tambourine? She said, no, I washed it off. I said, damn, I want that tambourine. Woo! A tambourine with some blood on it is some real Mississippi folklore. You know what I'm saying? I want that tambourine. But I did write a song. Call get the hell out of Clarksdale. But I was able to write this final verse for this song too, because this is an old song. But I, I wrote this new verse. I was like, yeah, I got some more to this song. She got tambourine, you better watch your tone. She gon' get sideways, she gon' Send you home back down road in a real slow. Yeah, I know he's nice and show the juke John Shaker. Stank on it, don't it? Uh, that's got some serious stank. I do love Louisiana. I do love Texas. But damn, I love Mississippi, man. Something about it, man. I rode my motorcycle. I got a Harley. I rode from Dallas to Mississippi. I slept on the side of the road there. Arkansas. Man, there's nothing like riding a motorcycle just... Head down those roads, all those crops everywhere. And then you know that, man, you breathe in the same air that Muddy Waters and Sun House. John Lee Hooker. It's just a, wow. It's amazing, man. I love it. With this song here, it's called My Mississippi Lady. Now, obviously, it's about Mississippi. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
song man I just I gotta admit I drink a lot when I write songs so a lot of times I don't even remember writing it I'm like damn that's a pretty good song who wrote that did you write that <laughs> I will I, I will more brag maybe just a pinch my last two CDs were Grammy contenders so this year my co-producer's like Scott he's like Mr. Janky He's like, you gotta go full janky this year, cause you gotta be the jankiest the janky you've ever janked. I'm like, that sounds, I don't know, that sounds dirty. That sounds dirty, I might need to take a shower.
I wrote that song a long time ago, man. It's fun writing that stuff. All right, I'm going to change one more guitar, all right? How am I good? How am I on time here?
try to trick him. I'm like, uh, real quick. Uh, uh. <laughs> James Brown on him. Hit me. I'm gonna do one more song. Is that cool? How much time? I don't know how much time I got left, but There's another song I wrote here. When I played this song in the studio, I had Robert Kimbrough on drums. You know, when you have somebody as amazing as Robert Kimbrough, who grew up in a juke joint, listening to Junior Kimbrough and R.L. Burnside, we finished recording this song. He goes, that's a Holy Ghost jam. I said, Holy Ghost jam? Goes, yeah, that's a Holy Ghost jam. I said, what's that mean? He said, makes you want to stand up for the Holy Ghost. I said, I, I take that. So this song here is called Sanctified Boogie. The Holy Ghost Jam. a beautiful place and damn those trees those big ass pine trees oh it's amazing it's beautiful grew up fishing every summer my mom would say get out of the house pack myself a sandwich and i go fishing all i do is fish man hey, what do they say sportsman's paradise am i wrong this here is cody cotton man he one of my best friends Great dad, he got twin girls, he's a good man. Now, I tell you what, if you ever looking for a Santa Claus, go look him up. He grows that beard. He made some good coin over Christmas, you know. Double bass, DB. Solid, great guy. Traveled the world, lived in Thailand for 10 years, and now he's getting janky. Back here on the drums, I got CC Ryder, Chad. Retired Army, served our country 
I'm very, very grateful to him. I'd like to thank you guys for inviting me to play here. Otherwise, I'd just be doing this in my backyard, smoking some meat, drinking some beer. Then I'd move over to that bourbon. Gotta get my bourbon on. Me an old fashioned. I got me one of those new things, it's like a skull, and you put some cherry wood in it. You get that smoke on your cocktail. You know what I'm saying? Smoky cocktail. I'm 54 now, so I grew up playing jazz. I learned to smoke a pot back then, like old school, smoke a pot. I'm back into it hardcore now, man. I be smoke, I got all my, I came, we came from Austin, I got my little case, I got all my different blends. I got my two pipes. So, I'm just trying to turn you guys onto something cool, you know? So much, I'm janky, man. I love playing this stuff. So, like I said, if I wasn't here, I'd be playing in my patio, throwing the ball for my dog. Like I said, drinking some cold beers, then move over to that dang bourbon. You know what I'm saying? That Buffalo Trace. Give it up for Janky and the Juke Joint Boys! If you like what you heard, they got CDs over there at the table at the New Orleans Blue Society. We're gonna take a little break, and then we're gonna come back. We're gonna have a chat with uh, Charles Gillum, Chris Thomas King, and we're gonna have the video playoff finals. So stretch your legs, get something to eat. Make sure you visit Donnie at the bar. Make sure you tip your bartender, and give a big round of applause to all the sound guys, Danny, Danny, and Travis. It sounded great up here, man. It sounded great. So obviously I overindulged. <laughs> so we'll be right back in about an hour. Thank you all so much. <laughs> <laughs> 